Welcome back to the end zone. I love saying that. Let's get right back to the highlights. We got Patton Springs taking on Dawson out in Welch. Dragons up early. Devin Ayers Mendez on the scramble. Going to go air mail it to Jake Morado. Coming right at our end zone camera. Touchdown for the Dawson Dragons. They led 19 8. Rangers coming back down 19 14. Michael Garza. Going in the beast mode, gets it into the end zone name of the show. Patton Springs takes the lead. Later on, Garza showing off his arm, connecting with Zevin Barron, making it a two score lead for the athletes from Afton. Late in the half, Michael Garza going to find Jody Garza. And late hire Dustin Ladd gets his first win as the Rangers coach, Patton Springs, 40 to 19. Number 11, Silverton. Boys Ranch. Owls go to work. It's Zayden Ortiz going to get the snap. He'll pitch it back to Jace Alvarado. And he's going to get into the end zone untouched. Silverton was up 12-0. Later in the first quarter, Ortiz again faking the pitch, but going to underthrow this one. But Alonzo Beltran coming at, snagging it, gets in for the score. Boys Ranch, coached by Lewis Kelly, grandson of the legendary Estacada coach. First six-man game for Boys Ranch, but Silverton wins it 63-33. A new homeschool team, West Texas Tornadoes at Southland. Southland up 14-0. Tornadoes going to give it to Isaac Kelly. He'll take it outside and down the sidelines for the first ever score for the West Texas Tornadoes. They were down 14-6. Southland, Caleb Sanchez right up the middle. This eagle soars into the end zone, extending the lead. In the third, West Texas quarterback Bryson Burke scrambling. He's going to find Kelly on the other side, and he will take it in for the touchdown for head coach Bill Strickland's team, but Southland wins it 51 to 38. Out in Jayton, number 10, McLean, facing number 18, Kroll. First quarter, McLean, fourth down. Wyatt Hagler going to find Colin Austin in the end zone. First touchdown in the state of Texas. This was an early game. 6-0 Tigers. Then Hagler going to find Strand Henderson. Dodging a few tackles. He will get in. McLean gets the win. 46 to nothing. Bonus coverage. Amarillo taking on Odessa. Opening kickoff of the game. Going to Amarillo's Bryson Brown. Catching the ball. And look at him swerving to the left. And then right past the defense. He will take it all the way to the house the game about 15 seconds old and right after that a lightning strike and they are still in the delay the game only two minutes old and right now six nothing amarillo if they continue to play that more games tomorrow night i cannot wait stay with us we'll be right back